So we will now talk about the preparations of ECRA conference. Please, can you tell us about the preparations there, how it was developing, about the communications with ECRA organization and so on? Well, uh, it, I wouldn't say it's not a hard work. It is. And it also uh, takes a lot of time because ECRA puts emphasis on detailed uh, preparations. So first we had to win the conference. We applied with the bid and uh, the bid was passed uh, by the uh, ECRA board. So we won the competition and then it took about uh, two years uh, to go through the entire uh, process of preparation. It has to follow so-called terms of reference. This is something like a format. Uh, uh, ECC is actually a format, uh, something like uh, Big Brother uh, or American uh, Pop Idol. Uh, and. Uh, particular local organizers uh, kind of uh, make uh, uh, this uh, format uh, live. And what about the, 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 the location that you've actually found where a crowd will, will actually happen? It wasn't that difficult because uh, Prague uh, does not have that many buildings that could um, uh, host uh, such a large conference. So there were about three opportunities and uh, we selected uh, the Congress Center Prague, uh, the former so-called Palace of Culture. Uh, for the technical uh, um, uh, for the technical facilities it provides uh, uh, it was the main reason but also uh, because of the history it used to be the pl the place the building where uh, the communist party uh, convened uh, in the past and uh, we actually understood this um, association together uh, with uh, the conference theme uh, referring to memory and mediated memory as a challenging thing thank you